Starting a new profession can be challenging, especially if you are switching industries. The road is particularly challenging for PhD holders looking to make the switch to a corporate job. This is due to the stark differences between the academic and corporate worlds. Additionally, graduate students receive little to almost no career preparation at the majority of universities. As a result, freshly awarded PhD holders who choose not to pursue academic careers are thrust into the commercial world without any preparation. They are instructed to send out resumes or CVs repeatedly while also receiving some networking advice. Do you know? What? You can easily get a job just before completion of a PhD. However, how and what to do for this, this is a different topic. In today's video, I have brought an excellent opportunity for all recent PhD holders or newly PhD graduates in Europe. As you know, I always bring the opportunities which are hidden and most of you are unaware of these kind of jobs and opportunities. So without wasting your time and my time, let's come to the point here. This opportunity is New College Graduate Program Europe at one of the leading company of the world in semiconductor business. The company name is ASM. This opportunity is in Finland and Belgium. Moreover, this opportunity is for all students irrespective of their nationality. This opportunity is for PhD students or PhD graduates to switch from academia to industry. So what is this New College Graduate Program? Number one, this is provided by ASM. ASM is a leading global supplier of semiconductor wafer processing equipments. Number two, for the first two to three years, you will be working in R&D section in Helsinki, Finland, or live in Belgium. Number three, you will play a pivotal role in the strengthening the connection between business and R&D. Number four, the goal is to cultivate and nurture the next wave of technical experts, project managers, or leaders of ASM. You will work, number five, you will work on challenging process development projects and at the same time participate in internal and external training. Number six, after some time, you will be assigned to lead projects where you can use your creative abilities to overcome tough technical obstacles and drive new R&D breakthroughs. Number seven, with a mentor from a business unit and expert partner, you will work with other talented researchers from around the world. Number eight, after completing the program through multiple assignments and training, you will be transferred to a designated product line and apply your advanced knowledge. So what do you think about this opportunity? Okay, let's discuss later, but first we will see the requirements. Requirement is PhD degree in physics, physical chemistry, chemistry, material science, or any engineering field, but you must have interest towards the semiconductor field. You must have solid knowledge in areas like chemistry or material science or physics of semiconductors and basic knowledge of semiconductor device integration process or former experience in the semiconductor industry will be asset, but it is not required, right? So if you are like from physics or like uh, from electronics field or electrical field or any related field like you and you if you have the interest towards the semiconductor field then you must apply for this position this is the best opportunity for you as a phd graduate to switch from academia to industry and one of the leading industry one of the leading company in the semiconductor field okay let's see the other requirements so you must have the fluent and spoken and written english and excellent communication and presentation skills okay so the requirements are you must be willing to relocate starting at uh, one of the corporate r d centers in finland or belgium and you also sh should have willing to move to other business units in us and Tokyo, Japan, or Seoul, South Korea. However, these jobs are basically like open for uh, R&D centers in Finland and Belgium. You thrive in different cultures, quickly learn new skills, and want to be driving force in global teams, right? So you should be highly enthusiastic, right? And uh, you should have some eagerness. You should have some energy, like to learn, like okay. So after PhD, because it is like you you understand that right? it is very tough. Like for example. 
a PhD graduate to switch from academia to industry. However, now, like for example, I will tell my story later on, but now I think the trend is now changing now. Now more PhDs are moving like uh, from academia to industry. Well, well, the requirements are you want to take the leadership role and accept the responsibility of solving problems and getting results. You communicate well. You can clearly and simply express advanced concepts both verbally and in writing. So you understand that basic English communication, writing and uh, like uh, listening and speaking you must know because you know like without english it's very difficult to get a job like at this level especially in the multinational companies okay so how to apply like you understand how to apply so before like uh, application if you have other like uh, for example queries or if you need to ask any questions related to the this recruitment process please contact jessica i will provide the email you can see this email here and i will also provide this email at the description box of this video so you can directly contact her and you can ask like if you have any question related to this recruitment process okay and about the application so here is the online link you can see here in the online link i will uh, like uh, provide at the description box of the video but uh, please remember that first you have to create your account right so you need to create your account because uh, first time you are applying so you have to create an account when you create a user account then you have to apply with your email address and password okay so what do you think about this opportunity in my opinion this is the best opportunity because these type of opportunities are like i can say the rare opportunities so if you are not eager to and if you are like uh, not eager to apply for this position and please like uh, share this position to different phd holders who are recent phd graduates and uh, who are still in the final year of their phd's they must apply for this position this is the best opportunity to shift to the one of the best industry okay that's it for today and i hope like uh, uh, I hope I you enjoyed this video and you got the information what I wanted to share with you and uh, very soon I will come with the um, more job positions and more phd and postdoc positions in europe for the english speaking candidates so thank you very much and see you in the next video please stay connected with this education europe don't forget to share subscribe and uh, click on the bell icon okay so thank you very much see you in the next video bye bye